Meghan and Harry recovering from unmitigated disaster after Callis family reception. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's attempts to bridge the gap with the royal family were met with indifference as they were repeatedly marginalized during their stay in the UK, royal author Christopher Anderson claimed. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle returned to the UK for a brief stay to mark the Queen's Platinum Jubilee in London last week. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have been having a rather frosty relationship with several members of the royal family since their decision to step down from public life was announced in March 2020. Author Christian Anderson suggested the couple's hopes to mend fences were met with resistance as they were meticulously choreographed out of major family moments. Mr. Anderson told Royally US, the whole world was watching and waiting to see if fences would be mended. If the Sussexes got back together with the rest of the family. From that standpoint, it was an unmitigated disaster. It's hard to see how the royal family could have been any more callous towards the Sussexes. They were meticulously choreographed in every instant to be sidelined and marginalized. If Harry went to London's Jubilee celebrations hoping to mend fences, that didn't happen. He added, they literally turned their back on him at St. Paul's Cathedral. It was handled in a very cold and somewhat heartless way. Meghan and Harry are known to have been attending Trooping the Colour but did not take part in the carriage procession traditionally reserved for working members of the royal family. They later appeared at the service of Thanksgiving in St. Paul's but skipped on a lunch at Guildhall other senior members attended right after.